Pag-usapan naman natin ang iba't ibang henerasyon. Baby boomer ka ba? Generation X ba? Generation Y ba? O baka naman Generation Z ka? What about the Alpha Gen? Pero bago ang lahat, like this video, subscribe, and click the notification bell. Silent Generation who were born in 1945 and before. The baby boomers, born 1946, 1964, Generation X, 1965 to 1976, Millennials or Gen Y, born in 1977 to 1995, Generation Z or iGen or Centennials, born in 1996 to 2009, and the newest generation, the Alpha Gen, born 2010 onward. Silent generation is hardworking, they have willpower, loyal employees, they respect authority, and silent generation can be tech challenge. They are very traditional. BB boomers were born in 1946 to 1964. They have strong work ethic. They are not afraid to put in a hardy day of work. They are self-assured. This generation is independent and self-assured. They are competitive and they like competition. They are, they are goal-centric, resourceful, mentally focused, team-oriented, and disciplined. Generation X were born in 1965 to 1976. They are also called Gen Xers grew up with minimal adult supervision and thus learned the value of independence and work-life balance. They also appreciate informality, are technologically adept, flexible, and highly educated. Generation Y or the Millennials were born in 1977 to 1995. Millennials are pampered, nurtured, by parents who didn't want to make the mistakes of the previous generation. Millennials are confident, ambitious, and achievement-oriented. They also have high expectations of their employers, tend to seek new challenges at work, and aren't afraid to question authority. Millennials are also called the generation we, the boomerang generation, the Peter Pan Generation. Time Magazine released an article titled Millennials, the Me, Me, Me Generation, which called the Millennials lazy, entitled, self-obsessed, and narcissist. On the other hand, they've been called open-minded, liberal, self-expressive, upbeat, and overtly passionate about equality. The Generation Z or iGen or Centennial were born in 1996 to 2009. One of the core characteristics of Generation Z is racial diversity. They are first digital natives. Whereas millennials were considered digital pioneers who bore witness to the explosion of technology and social media, Gen Z was born into a world of peak technological innovation where information was immediately accessible and social media increasingly ubiquitous. These technological advancements have had both positive and negative effects on Gen Z. On the plus side, an abundance of information is at their fingertips, allowing Gen Zers to broaden their knowledge and be proactive in their learning. On the other hand, too much screen time can compound feeling of isolation and lead to underdeveloped social skills. Additionally, technology is changing the economy, leaving the low-income Gen Zers vulnerable as they enter the workplace. Financial-mindedness is another core characteristic of gener Generation Z. Many Gen Zers grew up watching their parents take huge financial hits during the Great Recession. Having witnessed their parents' struggles, this generation is driven by pragmatism and security. 
While millennials came of age during an economic boom, Gen Zers were shaped by the economic pressures their families and communities faced. Mental health challenges are a sad characteristic of Generation Z, which has been referred to by some as the loneliest generation, as their endless hours spent online can foster feeling of isolation and depression. More time spent on smartphones or watching Netflix means less time spent cultivating meaningful relationships. Traditionally, many young people fall prey to the compare and despair trap that social media presents. They are the most likely generation to see the advancement of LGBTQ rights as a positive development. The Alpha Generation, the Alpha generation were, born on were born in 2010 onwards. Kilalanin natin sila. The Alpha Generation. Who are the Alpha Generation or Alpha Gen? Alpha Gen are those who were born 2010 onwards. According to literature, Alpha Gen do not like to share too much, unlike the previous generations. Their childhoods are a whole lot different unlike their millennial parents who enjoyed their free time playing outdoors and even spent large portions of days doing nothing, the Gen Alphas are different. They live in a world of constant cognitive stimulation so they need more structure in their days to keep them from fidgeting. Added to this is the peer pressure to perform well in school and invest time taking up extracurricular activities to excel. Many of the Gen Alphas by their nature tend to be defiant. It's hard to persuade them into religion or belief systems as they are inclined to break free from existing structures. Even when you successfully get them to accept a belief system at a tender age, they will soon outgrow it. They don't play by the rules. The time of playing board games and coloring between the lines is over. Gen Alphas cannot be restricted by rules like their predecessors. Their energies are hard to contain as their digital world puts them in touch with an infinite number of perspectives that stem a need to take ownership of themselves. Social media will be their dominant mode of interaction Gen Alphas will interact with their friends and peers mostly through social media and they are connected throughout the day. That also brings with it concerns about privacy and online bullying. Social acceptance also becomes a matter of how much they are liked online. While this becomes the norm, they need to be taught the importance of person-to-person -person interaction. Their learning is highly personalized. Gen Alphas are accustomed to having immediate access to information which makes lecturing and old models of learning obsolete. They will learn at their own pace with personalized learning experiences targeted to keep up with them. Along with the classrooms, online learning modules and tutorials will facilitate their approach to education. AI or artificial intelligence is their reality. It was impossible a generation ago for people to imagine the impact of Siri, Alexa, and Google's assistant in their lives and homes. For Gen Alphas, it's the exact opposite, I dominates their reality and is a natural part of their lives. It will also factor into how they will view the world with the ocean of information presented to them at every step. They are tech savvy. Their parents may have been the first to be born into a digital world but Gen Alpha will be the first to have a seamless integration of technology into every aspect of their life. In fact, Alpha Gen and technology are so intertwined that it is estimated by the time they are 8 years old, they will surpass their parents in technology skills. They will never know a world without the Internet of Things, smart technology, and virtual reality. They will be the most educated generation in history. Although most of them are still in infancy, by the time Generation Alpha comes to the age, they will be the most educated generation of all time thanks to the technology and instantaneous information available to them. They will grow up learning more and deeper about the world than all of their predecessors. This also changes the nature of higher education as it puts tremendously different expectations on the institutions. I hope you learned from this video. Please do not forget to like, subscribe and